and welcome to your market update charts of the day for today wednesday the 14th of june mike smith senior analyst at go markets here to lead you on what's happening as we approach the midpoint of the asian session today of course overnight we saw a positive session on wall street again with all major indices posting significant gains in yet another broad-based rally after that cpi data showed a decrease in u.s inflation the eyes are on the fed today of course but there is a 90 percent chance of a pause is what the market's pricing in after that soft cpi data and what the fed has previously telegraphed u.s futures are mixed in asian session asian markets generally far higher following that positive u.s lead asx is trading up around 0.3 percent there may be some caution today just in case the fed throw in a surprise but nevertheless at this stage all looks relatively bullish european futures are pointing to a mildly positive open as well and the vix is trading near neutral for the session just above those three year lows the us dollar index not surprisingly dropped after that cpi to bounce downwards off the 200 ema it's been testing for the last couple of days gold actually didn't move very much and remains in a range copper is pushed higher to test resistance and all is also bounced higher from a key support level it was testing yesterday bitcoin is trading near neutral and may test the 200 ema to the downside if there is any further selling and on the data front as well as that fomc rate decision tonight we've got uk gdp and trade balance eurozone industrial production and us ppi also due uh, eurozone and japanese rate decisions are also out in the next couple of days a couple of charts that caught our eye today we're going to start with ax1 uh, ascent group uh, and you can see we've got a really nice uh, example of a rounded bottom formation uh, after testing support here at 160. Uh, so buying pressure looks as though it's back in it's probably a little premature to start jumping into this already uh, but certainly with this trading at around about 174 uh, if we start to tackle 180 i think there could be some interest here for a potential move up maybe as far as two dollars that would make sense, be a nice round number, and be a move of just under 12%. On the FX front, then, the Aussie US looks interesting. We're back over that 200 EMA. Uh, we are stuck just under 68 cents at 67.89, which we've tested several times uh, over the last few months. We tested in February, March, April, and may before having this fairly significant retracement but over the last few days over the last couple of weeks we've seen this move back up to retest this level a breach of that would be significant if we look at the hourly chart uh, you can see there we had a, an attempt last night which failed so we'll be keeping all eyes on this looking for a break of 68. trade safe and we'll see you again soon bye bye for now